Gary Heider here with Midwest Automation. I'm at Mid-Atlantic Machinery in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, Steel Tech 2019. A lot of energy in the building, a lot of new state-of-the-art uh, fabricating machinery. Um, we're exhibiting two deburring finishing machines. We've got the Sidewinder behind us, a single-head 36-inch machine with uh, top brushes for deburring. And then I also have the Mighty Nine. That's our latest machine, uh, which has a belt head and a top brush module. And we'll go ahead and run some parts for you. A lot of energy, a lot of activity, and um, we'll see you on the other side. Let me tell you about the Mighty Nine here. Um, I had a young entrepreneurial couple drive nine hours from North Carolina yesterday, and they we ran parts and they bought a machine. Uh, they're buying a machine, identical machine here, but with a vacuum bed. Real nice people to work with. Uh, we were able to solve their application. They were handy burying 20 hours a week and uh, we were able to do their parts with one pass. So we got a collaborative robot here. I'm just going to sneak around the side here and show you the inside of the Mighty Nine. So we've got a belt head on the first position and then we got our top brush on the second position. So we'll go ahead and fire up the machine. I've got my wet dust collector here, the Niagara DC 800, 800 CFM. Got it. So here we have a piece of uh, hundred thousandths cold rolled steel that was cut on a trunk fiber laser pretty clean edge but sharp so we want to remove that burr we'll go ahead and run the part in got 180 grit built on the first head sneak by the robot here One pass on the Mighty Nine. You can see we took off the vertical burr, vertical dross. We got a nice radius, uh, removed all the sharp edges. Got a real good looking part here. And that is the Mighty Nine. There's a Sidewinder, 36 inch single head dry. We've got four 10 inch diameter top brushes. We're showing a uh, collaborative robot here to load the machine uh, offered by Mid Atlantic Machinery. I've got a hundred thousandths thick uh, piece of carbon steel. You can see it's got some pretty good, uh, well, pretty clean cut actually, but it's got a little bit of surface rust on it. We're gonna go ahead and run the machine uh, seven feet a minute. Watch the motor load. Part is engaged under the brushes now. You can see the four 10 inch diameter brushes oscillating back and forth, doing that work on the edge. And there we have it, a nicely deburred part. No longer have sharp edges and even removed uh, the surface rust. That's the Sidewinder TBR 37 inch machine.